How do you get your inspiration? Why is it not dropping down? Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's your girl Yami K back with another video. Ah, period. Mm, I don't say that, but like, you know. So, in today's video, I'm, we're going to be doing a QA. Well, I'm going to be doing a QA. I'm going to be doing a QA, and I hope you guys enjoy. I'm going to answer um, as many questions as possible. So, basically, these questions are from like my Instagram. Um, my Instagram story, I put a question and sticker asking people to ask me questions because I felt I needed to do like an updated version of like a QA and a and whatever. So that's what I'm doing today and I hope you guys enjoy. And yeah, there's this, I'm going to try to bring out my personality um, as much as possible because, you know, the vibes, you know the vibes, you know the vibes. Okay, give me a second, I need to find the questions first because... Um, your girl wasn't prepared for this, of course. I'm going to ask the questions. To start off, you all know my name is Yamikani Nyenga. If you don't know, my name is Yamikani Nyenga. I'm 20 years old. My birthday is on the 21st of September, 2001. In case you guys want to, you know, send me a little something, something. Just ask for my address and I got you. Ah, like, don't be creepy about it also. Um... My favorite color is blue. I find those as like odd things. But like you know, my favorite color is blue. Um, I currently live in the United States, in Laurel, Maryland to be exact. I feel like that's the basic information. My skincare routine. Slurp. You see guys, my skin has been glowing lately. Guys, my skin has been glowing lately. Oh, yeah. I don't know if it's this way that or it's what, but like, okay, well, currently I'm in um orlando florida so i think maybe this, this little you know this little atmosphere in the sun and the water i feel like it's just working well with my skin so yeah but like in general i'll probably give you guys like a skincare routine like here you go like you know, like another video if you can yeah and then my next question is how's life been in the united states i feel like i should do like a whole other video about like how it's been like my experiences and things like that like you know moving in everything because i didn't get to do that video i think i haven't started youtube but i'm gonna try um do another video on that so already that's like two videos look at me pushing things aside already that's like two videos um the next question okay the other question is also how is life in america and i feel like that question will probably be answered in that other video like um, moving to America and all that. I am currently in school. Yes, I'm in school. I currently go to Montgomery College. Um, I'm in my second year. Um, my major is cyber security. And guys, it's burning. Guys, schools are scams. Uni is a scam. Everything's just not working. To what I, you know, I guess it's not what I expected. But like, um, currently it's like summer, summer break. It's a summer break. So I'm not going to school. Currently, uh, I'll go to school in like August like um the full semester but school has been good it's interesting but like in general guys school burns like it burns right this question is um who's your man's um the other question is are you single are you sexy do you want somebody um currently i am single same status as last is last year I'm waiting to be found. I'm waiting to be found. But in general, if I can meet someone at this stage and like things are on fire, why not? Why not? Manifesting a vacation, guys. Like I've been thinking about it lately, and I'm like, oh, it would be so nice to go on like a vacation. But let me grow up. 
Let me crow. Let me crow. Um, okay, the next question is Have you always been into one thing? Actually, no. Um, but then back home, I always used to want to like to model, but like I didn't do like deep deep research and try to get into it. Like I would always be like, oh, I'd love to be a model. Oh, I'd love to be a model. And also, I had people complimenting me. They would be like, you know, Miami, you have like a model's body and things like that. And then like you know, I was just like, ah, okay, it'll go. And when I got here, right, like I was opportunities, like now i'm researching and i'm finding out about agencies and things like that and i'm like you know what let me actually start applying and that's how i ended up getting into modeling so basically i applied to agencies then before i was with a kid agency in minnesota right but like i'm not with them anymore i'm now kind of with amg in new york I just recently signed with them so that's going to be an interesting experience um, this question Anzi what do you miss about Zimbabwe the most and do you plan on moving back no I am not moving back <laughs> I never I'm not moving back I will probably go there visit if I want to go on vacation for like two three months yeah that's fine um, the question um do you miss Zim I do. I miss my family and things like that. I actually do miss it. If I'm going to say more, in fact, no, I'm not going to say more about this question. I will put it in the other video. For more content, guys, for more content. When did your last relationship end? This one. Yes, guys. When did. Okay, so the next, the next question is when did your last relationship end? I think it was like in February. My last relationship ended in February, guys, and that's another story time because there's juice in that story. There's juice in that story. You have done it again, constant lowering the bar for us all, and doing it flawlessly. Because, you know what? If you're watching this, okay, the next question is: Have you ever had skin problems? Um, no, not really. I don't want to lie to you. No, I've never really had like skin problems. Yes, at some point I had like really bad pimples. It was like when I was back at home, I had like bad pimples. They were not like really bad guys. They were not even care. You know, to my boon boon from time to time, like those challenges. But my skin was never like this. My, my skin was never like this. Now my skin is popping and it's yet to pop even more. Um, but before my skin was just a bit dusty and rough and like yeah that those are probably like the skin problems i had but i've never had anything deep like acne and things like that no i've never had those things never had those things never so the next question is what would you tell your younger self probably like six years ago that you wish they knew okay i personally would tell yeah 14 year old yamikami Ooh, tea. Be delusional. Be delusional, guys. Be delusional. And people be like, yeah, you know, no, no, reality, reality. That's a lie. Let me that's a lie. Being delusional, guys, I feel like it's. Personally, it's helped me get this far. Being delusional has helped me get this far. So I will continue to be delusional. This thing of, um, you know what, go argue with your ancestors. This thing of people telling you, oh, be yourself, she, 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 don't want, that's like the laziest advice I've ever heard. Be yourself, that's the laziest advice I've ever heard. So personally, like, I wouldn't give you the advice with hey, be yourself. Honestly, don't. Do what works in the moment, do what works in the moment. So that's like one thing I'll tell them. Second thing, be delusional. Third thing, stop caring about what other people say. Just do whatever you want. Just do, just do. And at the end of the day, in the future, no one is going to be paying your bills because you're going to be like, hey guys, I'm so scared of what people are going to say. Especially if, if you're into like social media and all those things, you're going to be like, hey, I'm so scared of what people are going to think. Hey, sh -sh -sh -sh. my G. If you're dancing like whatever, if you're twerking and Jane men, if you're twerking on social media and you're doing whatever you want and it's giving you back, at the end it's you against the world. It's you against the world. If it's giving you back, if it's paying your bills, I'm gonna go for it. That's like my advice. I would give myself, but like, go for it. Whatever's paying most, go for it. But then I wouldn't tell myself to 
be a bad influence or like to do like horrible things. No, I wouldn't do that. But like point, you get all my points. is be delusional. Stop caring about what other people think. Um, be yourself. Be yourself. I mean, like obviously, for example, be yourself works when you're getting to know somebody. Yeah, when you're getting to know someone. That's when be yourself works. Otherwise, be yourself. Be yourself is a scam. This person's actually just me like um, the type of people I would date. Would I date like older guys or like um, younger guys? Um, okay, by younger guys. Okay, by younger guys, she means like people my age and probably one year under. Or um, older guys. Older guys, she means like six years older um, or whatever. You know what? I I've dated first episode I was younger than me. I dated a person that was my age. I dated a person that's like a one year older than me. And three years. I don't know if I've dated. No, I've dated someone who's three years older than me. Six years is a bit much, but I feel like as you grow older, that gap isn't really. It isn't really much. Because sometimes if you look at some of your parents, if you look at some of your parents, their age difference is like five years, if you get what I mean. So personally, if I click with the person and everything is proper, proper, our maturity levels are, you know, are meeting. You know, if our maturity levels are meeting and we click and everything works well, why not? Why not? So personally, I would, actually, I would date. Someone who's six years older than me, I would date someone who's one year older than me. I would date person that's one year younger than me, but I would not date someone who's two, like six years younger than me. Going down there, it's a year, or maybe two years. A year, maybe two years. As long as you look bigger than me, don't try to look else. As long as you look bigger than me, um, it's getting a uh, man hard in the states. No, it's not hard. It's actually quite easy. What? It's actually quite easy, but it depends on what your intentions are, right? If you want to get somebody that you want to do smash, smash, one to one, two, fa, fa, ta, right? You can get them, like, like this. A person that you want to do your things for like one day and then that's it, right? You'll find them. Click off your, click off your finger, you'll find them. But if you want someone with something serious, that's a bit harder. If you will. that's a bit harder. Like that's basically it. It's hard if you're looking for something that's really, really serious. This is my opinion, by the way. Please let's not come and attack each other and say Bridget said this. I'm coming. Why you saying this? I'm not Bridget. Next question is: As a baddie, what's your relationship with God like? My relationship is like that. God is my homeboy. I don't even know you one boy. But like basically my point is me and him are like this. We are one. We are one. Honestly, I wouldn't be here today if it wasn't for him. Like um, and no one can convince me otherwise, by the way. No one can convince me otherwise. So when was the last time you did the deed? I have never done the deed. Um I don't plan on doing it anytime soon. But when my husband comes, when my husband comes. <laughs> But I don't plan on doing it anytime soon. So the next question is, what's your worst fear, man? You cannot be for real. Oh my God, you for real. That's it, men. Men, men. I'm joking, guys. No, my worst fear used to be clowns. But like, not anymore. Not anymore. Just a tiny bit, though, a tiny bit. But I'm like, not anymore. Now I'm just. I'm probably snakes. Snakes are like the next big thing. Like, I feel like I would die if I saw a snake like right in front of me. I feel like I've never experienced that for a reason. Like, I've never had like a snake be in front of me for a reason. Like, probably like in a glass box or something, but never in front of me. I feel like God knows. God knows that if I was to stay, I would freeze. Probably freeze and die. And like, He knows what He's doing by not making me encounter a you know, kind of snake underground. Who no be will. I feel like I've answered um, most of the question. Oh, someone asked me. Someone's asked me before if I'm Nigerian or Zimbabwe. Or, eh, if I'm Nigerian or Zambian. No, guys, I'm not Nigerian. I'm not Zambian. I'm Zimbabwean. 
Why do I always look at women and think I'm Zimbabwe? Is this like a disease? I'm joining guys. I'm from Zimbabwe. Okay, guys. So thank you so much for watching. Um, those are the questions you guys asked me, and I tried as much as possible to answer them to the best of my ability. I tried to answer them to the best of my ability. Um, if you got to the end, thank you so much for watching. Let me, let me, no. let me. Please make sure to subscribe. Please make sure to subscribe. Okay guys, so please make sure to subscribe, make sure to like, comment, share, turn on your post notifications and tell your friends about this channel, you know guys. Anyway guys, see you next time.